We have a lot of folks coming in and asking us about what they can do for their knees, uh, especially uh, after they've started to develop pain in their knees. Uh, we know that arthritis is defined as mild, moderate, severe, and it can affect the medial compartment, the lateral compartment, and the patellofemoral compartment of the knee. Um, if we've got a knee model here, that would, uh, that would include uh, the outside, the inside, and the patellofemoral uh, aspect of the knee. What we know is that about uh, 700,000 knee replacements are done per year uh, in the United States, and there's an estimated uh, over 3 million uh, by the time 2030 comes along uh, that will be done. Uh, and, and so knees are, are quite important to folks who have them. Typically, um, people will present with knee pain uh, more than they do dysfunction, and that, lend, that leads them down the path of a replacement. Uh, here at the uh, uh, the Centennial Schultz Clinic, our goal is to, uh, to try to prevent uh, knee replacements if possible, and, and we do this by stabilizing the joint, but also by identifying very precisely using MRI, ultrasound, and x-rays the area of deterioration or degeneration. And by doing so, we're able to then target that area uh, for repair or, uh, or regeneration. This is done uh, typically by taking stem cells from one's own body, uh, and using them uh, to, we process them in a lab uh, in, our, in our clinic and then uh, place them exactly where they're needed, uh, not anything more, not anything less. We see knee patients every day and the majority of the knee patients that we treat uh, report to us that their pain uh, decreases significantly. And when pain decreases significantly, we, we see frequently that the function increases. And our goal uh, here at our clinic is to get people doing what they want to do uh, and not limiting them or telling them what they cannot do.